Good day, ma'am and class. Today I'll be speaking to you about my roller coaster, the criteria of the design, the evaluation of my design, and actually why my roller coaster, Space Rampage, actually works. The details of the criteria of the design. The height is 128 meters off the ground. The color of the rails are green. The supports are blue and my cart is blue and gray. The length of the ride in time takes 1 minute and 41 seconds to get around the track fully. And the minimum speed is 11.3 km per hour and the maximum is a whopping 120.7 km per hour. Now for the evaluation of my design. The position of maximum potential energy of my cart is calculated using the following formula. Force times distance. So my cart weighs 500 kilograms. So you change it to 5,000 newtons. So you say 5,000 newtons times 128 meters and that will give you 640,000 joules of potential energy at the highest point of my roller coaster. So the position of maximum kinetic energy and potential energy is also 640,000 joules at one meter off the ground. So the amount of work being done to get the car to the starting point is 640,000 joules. And you calculate this by saying force multiplied by the distance. So the amount of power my motor of my roller coaster needed to get the car to the starting height was 6,336.6 watts. You, you use this formula saying work done over time, which is basically 640,000 joules over 101 seconds. So the safety precautions required to ride my roller coaster are that you must be 1.5 meters tall and that you must make sure that you're strapped in properly. So the reason why my co roller coaster is so successful is because it generates so much potential energy once it has reached the starting height that it has enough kinetic energy to go around the whole track. Thank you. Enjoy the ride.